Hey folks, it's Rithgar here, how you doing? We are just powering up towards the island that we've just found. And I'm going to run on here and grab that and then come off. And then we can go over towards this one. And as soon as we get up against the island, we can drop the anchor. And what I'm hoping is that we will be able to get a whole load of scrap from around that one. Then we are also going to want to get a few other items. There, there's things that I want to get. If we, if we go forward, we can see it. There it is. Look, see? Slowly dropping. Um, right. Way anchor. No, drop anchor. Way anchor is um, lift it, isn't it? Right. So we've dumped the anchor down there. And then I can run back up here. And I'm going to just take that one up like that. There we go. And I'm going to hope that we are in the right place. So sort of, I, th I think we're going to be all right here. I think we're going to be all right. So we'll be able to go under the water and catch a few little bits. Is there a shark attack underway? I don't think there is. Um, so I've had a number of people telling me that I should be looking for more of those island, not, not the islands, more of those other things that we found. You know, the, the, the place um, we want to put out our beacons and radio mass and everything again. And yes, I do want to start looking towards some of those. Apparently, I should have spent a bit more time looking underneath the one that I found last time because I'd have found a lot more scrap there. But I mean, I didn't. So that, that was my bad. I probably should have done. Um... It is something that we will be doing in the future. We are going to be looking at that. Uh, what was I about to do? I want to go up on that island. There's something that I was going to do. I can't. I absolutely cannot remember what I was planning to do now. Um, I'm sure there was something. Oh, I do know that we need to do... We're going to need to do a little bit of fishing. If we're going to be able to get anything at all, we're going to need to do some fishing. Uh, food... I'll put food over in this one a minute. I'm going to drop all of our food in there. That is all of our food. Well, all of the food that is worth having. Grab those drumsticks as well. They can go in. That was from one of the seagulls that we managed to capture. And we've got... I've got some eggs. Nope, they can go in there as well. Everything's going in the box. Everything is going in the box. Because we're going to go up on the island and we're going to grab some stuff. And I'm also going to want like a, a bit of uh, safety reserve as well. So I'll drop that in there. And then this one over here, I've got some of the more valuable stuff. And I'll drop that one in and also stone. Now I've got a shark attack somewhere. He says. I could have sworn I heard a shark actually attacking. Maybe I didn't. Right, ladders is another thing that we're going to build. We will build some ladders so that we can more easily jump up and down and get around different places. But for now, we're not going to worry about them. So let's drop those in there. That is everything on there. And I think I've got pretty much everything that is going in the different places at the moment that I've, I've, I haven't even got space for anymore at the moment. That is a big problem. Space is a bit of a premium for us. We want to go to that one. No, no, no. I want to go to that one there and rope. And I'm going to craft another 30 pieces of rope. Can do that. Can do all of it. A single little bit into rope. There we go. So now we've got two stacks of 20 rope, which I can put both in there. And then the timber, that comes over here. And we take the timber into there. I've got a spare hatchet which I'm going to take with me over onto the island. And then I have a tatipo right there which is no good to anybody. So let's just eat that one as it is. One raw tatey po. And we've got our trophy room here that we're going to start. We're going to carry on doing the trophy room. I'm going to keep putting more sharks on, but we need um, more scrap to be able to do that properly. Uh, so it's also on the to-do list. So let's get over onto the island here. We've got another one of the crates right there. What do we get? We've got one scrap, one goo, a couple of hinges, and some planks. So not, not a great haul, but still not too bad. Let's grab this lot. I'm going to ignore flowers and stuff for now. I don't know where about those. Um, we will need to be coming back to the islands in order to get more coconut seeds, uh, more palm seeds, apparently, because uh, you don't get enough to completely replenish your supplies at all times. Um, so we may do quite well with our little forest that we've got going. For a while, for a time, but this is not going to be like a, a permanent thing. Same with like the watermelons and anything else that we seem to be picking up. We don't. You're not going to get like a permanent supply of seeds. We are going to be running out of seeds uh, fairly quickly, to be honest. 
let's just swap those over and then I've got oh no coconuts they're water aren't they it's mangoes that is the more food than water I think there's everything on this little bit up here excellent so now we can come down here and get some more mango take that one out scrap we need lots of and plastic as well I don't know if there's going to be like stuff that we can do with plastic later on maybe I, I'm not really sure how that's going to work but at the moment, plastic is... We, we got loads of it. I don't really know what to do with the stuff. I'm thinking that we will use a load and we'll extend our raft out by quite a considerable margin compared to what it is now. I think that could look pretty good. I'd like to see at some point in the future, um, in a future update of the game, a like an option to build walls and stuff out of just plastic or mostly plastic and a little bit of timber or something like that you know because you, you like making use of the different bits of plastic that you find i think that would be a pretty cool theme to have there we've got one tree over on that side that i want to get we need to go up to get that okay now i do have a shark he says no sharks over there is he attacked or not i don't think he has I think I keep, I just keep hearing things every single time I'm hearing things and that's all it is. There has been no shark attack. It has all been in my head. Okay, down here and that's underwater. So just this bit. This is the last tree. And then we need to do some fishing. I will do some fishing. I will craft ourselves a fishing rod and I will fish and I will get scrap because I want lots of scrap and I reckon that if I jump down I'll be able to find quite a lot. Uh, don't know if there's very much else I desperately want to find, but we'll see. I didn't actually catch very much for using. I think it's the raw herring and that one, which you can use for shark bait. Yeah, that is it. So I only caught two. Fortunately, I already have two of those, so we do have something. I did get a salmon. I also got another catfish, and I got three little tilapia as well. So we'll take that one, and... I think we're only going to want the one to start with, so I'm not going to worry about too much more than that. We'll take a, a thing of these and we'll craft our own ropes a minute. Oh, no, I'll tell you what, I will actually make both of these so that I don't accidentally eat the wrong item. So if I make those, I'll make four of them, we can craft that one and I craft that one. So I've now got two shark baits, and shark bait can go in the food box, because it is technically kind of food, even though it's not food. And, yeah, so th that'll be fine. And then, what else do we want? We can eat that one. And I'll eat those three. Even though they don't offer very much nutritional value. And we are very nearly almost daytime, but it's not quite daytime. So we're going to go around this way and we're going to go to sleep a minute until it does actually get to daytime. We'll store the feathers away and we'll lay down and have a little nap. Dawn! Right. I could do with a bit more to eat. It's the food value that I need most, rather than the, the water value. Let's go back over here, and I'll put those in there, and I will take those a minute. So I'll just eat that one. I only need to eat the one. And then we'll put that one back. Right. I'm ready to go. Yes, I do have my hatchet and my spear on me, but that's fine. I'm, I'm willing to make that small sacrifice. All I want to do is I want to come over here, and I want Mr. Sharky Poos... To come out. To come and play. Where are you, Mr. Sharky Poos? Hello? Hello? Shark? Hello? Hey, here. It's right behind you. Go for it. There you go. Atta boy. Atta boy. Right, while you're doing that, I'm in here. And I'm going to get some seaweeds. I'm going to get some seaweeds there, and I'm going to get... I'm not going to get for those. No, but I am going to get that one. I want some scrap, and I don't know why I'm bothering for clay. I don't need clay at all. I definitely don't need clay. I could do with being able to swim faster. I forgot to upgrade my fin. Uh, well, to, go, to, to make new fins, but uh, we will get that. I don't really need a lot of this. I got several of these already, but, you know, as we're here, as we're hanging around this area, we may as well get some of them. A uh, bit of sand, a bit more clay, a bit of sand. I'm not going to go, ooh, there, a bit of scrap there. And get those two, and then head up to the surface. Go, 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 go! We got one more dive. One more dive before the shark uh, comes after us. He's probably going to come after us anyway, 
He's probably already finished with his little um, snack that we gave him, little toy. So we want to just quickly go through now and we want to get this. I do want to keep an eye out for more copper. If I find more copper, that would be good. And also the seaweed. We'll take the seaweed as we're getting it. Um, but no, the reason I want more copper is because if we're going to be using more of the battery thing, we're going to want to be able to possibly craft more batteries. So let's make sure we've got a few materials ready for it. That shark is going to be on me any second. Ooh, there's a whole thing under here. Right, where is there? there where is it? There, pick up the crate. That gave me some more stuff, but now I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I'm actually stuck. Metal. 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 Go, go. Ah! No, that's the shark. That was the shark, and I'm drowning. Okay, things are going wrong. Things are definitely going wrong. Go, 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 go. Up you go. Right, and where is that shark? Right, I, oh, I did really well. I got ten scrap. Okay, let's have a look in here. Uh, I got some bolts. I got that. I got uh, some of that. Oh, I think I got that from the chest. I got the scrap. This. Bit of clay and sand. That's all I got the space for. We keep hold of the sand and the seaweed. Right. This is looking promising. This is looking very promising. I am going to go back in the water because there's more scrap around here. There's a giant clam over there. I'm not too worried about clams, actually. I don't really care about the clam. Oh, 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 he's over there. Right. Well, if he's already attacked, let's do the... Oh, actually, I, can, I can't take any more attacks. So I'm just going to stay up here. I know I have another shark bait. I know I got another shark bait. I am aware of that. I haven't forgotten. But I'm going to be stubborn. And I'm going to do this without using another shark bait. I'm going to go and I'm going to fill this one up with fresh water. I don't know why I'm filling it with fresh water. I'm going to have a drink. I only need to have two drinks. I need to... Well, I'll, I'll take the drink with me. And I'm going to go and get a bit of food. And then we can replenish some health at the same time. We've got some food in here. I've got watermelons, uh, I've got that, and I've got some eggs. So let's have that and some eggs a minute. There. Eat that and uh, eat an egg as well. Right, that is completely full, so I'm hoping that my health will start to replenish a little bit. And while I'm waiting for that to replenish, you know I could go up and I could build a little bit. Oh, no, 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 no. Yes, I can. I've got some materials. So we could actually start doing a little bit of work on here. I got scrap. Look at all this scrap that I got. This is awesome. And take the rope. Let's go and have a little chat with him. Because, I mean, if he dies... You know, we could just jump into the water. Instead of worrying about that, we could have just jumped in. I I can replenish it. I can do that because I don't have much timber on me. Uh, I've got some timber on me. I, 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 I Yeah. I know what I meant. I, I knew what I meant. And I've also got in here, i got a little bit more scrap. I've got 15 scrap here. 15! That's actually pretty good. Uh, nothing else there for a second. No, but what I can do is I can make some more nails. And this is the important bit. I want to make some nails. One, two, three, four. That gives me 12 nails, which is six poles. I make six poles with that. So I'll go to there and I'll take a couple of stacks of... Several stacks of timber, like this. And then I can go to you, and I can go to the tall pole. Right, uh, it's got to come out to that one. And then that one there is going to be the other bit. So then it's got to be that one. And it's going to be that one over there. And then I don't know how much bigger. Let's, let's go with this for now. Let's, let's just do it like this to start with, and then we can move from there. I need a little bit more. Crafty. Crafty. So that makes six. There's three more poles that I can make if I want to. One, two. I don't need to make another one. That is all of the scrap in order to be able to build all those poles. That is actually a very expensive um, line of poles. There, wooden floor. Right. So now I've got the wooden floor that I can build out here like this. All the way out. There we go. I can't go any further that way. Or the other way. But I've now got this room. All the way around here. Now, I don't actually need this room to have any kind of lookout capability, do I? This it, it, It's walls that we want along the back. We want those walls. We want wooden walls along the back. I'm actually thinking, that would it look better using thatch walls? Maybe it might. Maybe I could actually do a pattern on this. So let's remove this wall there. 
And that one. And let's see. Oh, I've got some palm leaves. I've got enough palm leaves to see if this is going to work. I'll take a thatch wall there. Now that one, if I rotate it round, yeah, it goes that way. So we go like that. And we go like that. And then that one would stay. And then this one would become different. So let's just go down here and take a look. Do I want it to be, like, alternating like that? Or do we just have a timber wall? I think we'll just go for the timber wall. I think it's just going to be a bit e easier. I think it will look, ultimately, it will look a little bit better if we just go for the straight timber wall. Uh, so we'll do that one. And we'll take that one off. And then we can put them back again, like this. There. Right. That's got to be done. Yeah, we want it that way around. And that one there. And then we can do a line of these along here like this. I don't know if we need to go any... I don't know if I want to put anything along this side. I haven't quite made my mind up yet. I'm considering the possibility of going upwards like that. Maybe we will. I'm not quite sure. So, no, the next thing that we need... Oh, hang on. Uh, the shark heads. Yeah, the shark heads. This is the bit. I need nails. I need three nails for each of them. That's the bit. That's why I need more scrap. I, I don't have anywhere near enough scrap at the moment. I need loads more. Fortunately, I also have... There. And that one. Is that shark attacking? Don't think the shark is attacking. I'm going to fill that with seawater. Put that in there like that. And then I'm going to jump in the water carrying the scrap that I've got. Where is he? He's taken two pieces out over there already. Savage. He's savage. He really is. Right, let's jump in here. <laughs> that genuinely terrified me. The noise then really did terrify me. Right, and go. Right, I have fended him off. I've got just a few seconds to gather up some metal. Where is the metal? Where is the metal? There is no metal. Ah, there. One two. Ah! Oh! Right, I gotta keep, I gotta keep an eye out that direction for him. He's there somewhere. Here. Yeah. Uh-oh. Right, I did stab him, but at the same time, yeah, it, it didn't go quite as well as planned. So let's go this way and get out of here quickly before he comes back. Right, I have now diminished my health again. I didn't do that quite as well as I'd hoped, but I think I've now removed all the scrap. I'm just looking under here. Can I see any bits of scrap? No. There is no scrap left. Right. As we have removed all the scrap, I don't want anything else there. We'll lift that bit up, and I will take everything out of here, and we can put that upstairs so that it's nice and safe. And I have nothing else down here that I want. So we've only got five bits of scrap left. But I now have my island, uh, my island, my trophy room. I've now got a trophy room. And I'm very pleased with my trophy room. That was the whole idea of this little expedition was to be able to build a perfect trophy room. So let's put the goo in there. That is processed materials. Uh, I've got a clam that I want to put in there. There we go. There's another clam. I have no more seeds that I need to put in for a minute. I do have four of those. Let's go back over to this one, pick up a metal ingot, place a plank, and there's the shark. There he is. Can we get him? Is he ready to die yet? He's not ready to die just yet. He's he, he, He's got some, some living that he still wants to do. I'm going to go and get a bit of plastic a minute and we'll run some repairs on, the, on Rafty McGrath face here because, um, quite frankly... Things are not looking good. We've lost we've lost some bits. There's been some casualties. And it's not good. Look, we've lost two sections over here. So we've replaced those two. And then we'll run around the edge here and make sure that everything else is looking ship shape and tickety boo. Okay. All ship shape and all tickety boo. That's good. Right. Now we can go back up here and we want to be going in that wise direction. So I'm gonna to go to here and there. Oh, that way round. Like that. There. That's roughly the right direction. That's going well. And now I need to just move some stuff around here. Oh, let's just process the copper first. 
If I do that first, I can get that um, up and running. So there, I place the copper. Place copper, plank, and plank. Yeah, you're working. And then I can have a look in here, and I can actually kind of cook those three fish there, because the, the three will cook together perfectly without any problems. Right, one, two, three. That's doing nicely. And that's about it. I just need to do my shark trophy room. And this is, this is the big bit. This is one that's going to... I can take... Let me take two of those. Because I can make two shark trophies. I do have enough materials to make two shark trophies. And I also want to do that. I've got enough room in my bag. So I'm going to chop down all of these. And then once I've chopped... Oh! Uh-oh. That's the other problem. Is if I make two shark trophies, I'm not going to have enough... Um, materials to be able to make another hatchet and I'm going to need one. I don't have enough hatchet left to um, harvest these five trees. So that's, that's our next thing. I'm really hoping that in an update they do change, like have like a um, a better source of materials for hatchets. There, I've now only got three pieces of scrap. A better source of materials for, I don't know, scrap or if an alternative for a hatchet. Maybe we could um, craft a hatchet using metal ingots that lasts like three times as long. Is that? Oh, I thought I heard the shark again. Let me finish harvesting these. And then I'm going to get some sleep. And I'll also get the next lot up and running. And yeah, I got lots of stuff that I want to do. Let's get a bit of sleep. And then in the morning, we can continue on with all the things that we need to do. Uh, first up, let's, let's have a bite to eat. I've eaten... Have I eaten all the coconuts? Oh, I can't open it. Ah, there we go. Right. I have eaten all the coconuts. The trees are growing nicely. And I'm going to have a bit of breakfast. Have some fish for breakfast. There we go. And I've now got some materials that I can make some shark heads with. We're going to go into here. Shark trophy. Oh, I need... Yeah, I need I need the nails. So I I can only make one more shark head trophy at the moment because I don't have the scrap. I'm hoping that I will be able to get a bit of scrap from down here. I got a load of things here. So I got a barrel there. There's a piece of scrap. Got a shark attacking here somewhere. He's under the water, which isn't helping. One, two. He's not dead. He's not dead yet, but I think he will be soon. I think he's going to be dead very, very soon. I don't think he's going to last much longer. Another hit or two. And then we will have put him in his place. Finally. Now, next up, I'm going to take out that metal ingot. I'm going to put some sand in there so that I... Basically, I've got too much sand kicking around, so I just wanted to get rid of some of it. Um, I need some water. We'll, we'll worry about... Oh, hang on. Didn't I have watermelon in here? Yes, I did. Right. I'll take the watermelon, and I'll eat that. So I'll take that one. And then I'll have that one. Oh, the seagull. Oh, I scared the seagull away. Sorry, seagull. I got a load of eggs in there, though. No, I don't want another one of these there. If I do that, I can then craft that one. I still only... I've got two nails still. I've now got two shark head trophies, which we need to put on the wall. And the thing that we do with the shark head trophies is we take a name from the Great Book of Names. I'm going to put that one right there like that. And I need to just... Hang on. I've got to get my um, Book of Names. The first one to come up in the Great Book of Names is a Goose Man X. There we go. Done. There is Goose Man X. No, so I can't put them on there. I'm going to have to move it along by one place. So we'll put that one on to there. And next up, out of the Great Book of Names, Random Number Generation puts me on. I swear this Random Number Generator is not random because I've just had Goose Man X come up again. Uh, next one is Dante. Next one is Dante. So we put Dante in there. There we go. Done. Dante. So we've got the good gamer, we've got Gooseman X, and we've got Dante up here so far. As we get the rest of our sharks up here, we will get more of them. Uh, we will get more more names and so on. Can I get it? Can I get it? Can I get it? I got it! I actually got the seagull. We got more raw drumsticks to cook. Excellent. There we go. Raw drumsticks. Good eating they are. They are good eating. Uh, what else did I want to do? I've got some room up there. The problem I've got with this is to make the room bigger, I need to go up more on more stilts. I've got another idea for a different type of room that I'm going to build, and we will get to that. That is something that is on the to-do list. Uh, I want to put that one in there. That is done. That one... Have I got anything else I need to process? Seaweed, I think, now. It's all seaweed. 
So I put some seaweed in there and I'll start processing some of that. And then we take a look in here and I put the glass and I store you as well. And I'm not going to store anything else. So yeah, I do want more seaweed. I'm going to be able to, I'm going to want to build up some more seaweed stores. And the next bit was, now I could do this with mostly just timber. I've got some timber and I want to go, see, we're, we're going to be making use of the trophy room. I'm going to make use of this room. Uh, the other thing that I also wanted to do is I need to get some of the leaves. Uh, not plastic, leaves. I'll take some of you like that. And I want to go back over to here and I'll take the rest of that like that. Now, is that barrel going to be pick upable? It is, but we've got to go and get it. That was two pieces of scrap in That was definitely worth the trip. Yes, I do need to have more like holes and um, stuff around so that I can jump up and down a lot easier on here. We will get to that. That is another thing that is on my to-do list as well as... Right, I'm going thatch roof on this because that is four planks and that is just two planks. And we got loads of palm leaves at the moment. Um, so, yeah, I have on my to-do list an idea which I would like to participate in. Can I build... Oh, you can't go up to it. You can only do it like this. Right. That does make a bit of a difference to how I was planning to do this. No, I'm going to do it like that. I'm going to want to rotate you round. I was going to go out there. And there. I'll put you on there. And then I think... I'm not, I'm not quite sure how I do this now. I've got that one triangular thatch wall inverted and thatch roof corner right so i want the inverted corner i think i put that there oh hang on there that's what i'm after where is that shark where is that shark attacking there he is ah Okay, I, I probably could have done a little bit better getting out there in time. I did hear him, but then I didn't drop fast enough. I definitely, definitely could have done... I got loads of plastic there. I didn't really get anything else. I got some scrap. We have a little bit of scrap. But anyway, I want to go back over here. We've done the inverted one there. And then I want to go over here and I want to go thatch roof. And that's going to carry on out this way like this. So I can put that thatch out there. And then this one's going to go there so we got a double layer of this all the way out like that uh there why have you rotated you need to go that way and there and then we can go for the inverted thatch corner which will go up there like that and then i can go back to nope that one there you're going the wrong way you won't go that way oh there's an island over there that's one of those islands that has loads of stuff underneath it. Those islands are actually pretty cool. Now that bit there, I was, I'm not going to do anything with that. Then I'm also going to come up here and I'm going to remove this. I know this is like really cool. We've got this like really tall bit up here, but I think we'll remove it for now because I've got other ideas. I have ideas that I'd like to carry out and this one is going to be in the way of said ideas. So we've got to remove it. It's got to come down. Advanced achievement unlocked. This goes here. I don't know what that means, but um, I'm assuming it's a good thing. Achievements are always good. I love achievements. I love achievements. You can never have too many achievements. Put that one there. And then that one's going to come down there. Right, so we've got our shark heads. I don't really want to box the shark heads in. I want them to be able to be seen. Now, they're only going to be able to be seen from part of our ship. Not all of it, which is a little bit of a shame. But I mean... The, the way that I'm doing this is that we are going to be able to... I'm listening. We are going to be able to drop down from great heights to get to most of the different parts of the boat. So that's I'm figuring that's a, quite a good thing. So we've got some planks to go in there. And then I can come back over here to completed items. we got that and we've got that to go in. Uh, and some stone as well. That can go in. And then i got a potato and I've got... A, um, a beetroot, which, quite frankly, I, I don't care about. I, I, I don't want them. They're no good to me at all. So I'm going to just do that, and then I'm actually going to have a little... Oh, I would have a drink, but I forgot to refill the, the, the thingy here. So let's just put that in there like that. That can stay. Ladder. You know, we haven't actually built a ladder at all. Now, 
That one there, we've got like a... Yes, that would be a good spot, I think. Now, where is that wall? The wall is right there, so I want to remove that piece. Remove that piece, which is it? It's... Where's the wall? There's the wall. So if I remove this piece here... There. Right. And then a ladder. Do I need that one to stay? Looking round. No, I don't actually need that to stay at all. I don't know if I need it for the ladder. Let's see. Let's find out first if I need this for the ladder, because I've not built a ladder yet. So we go to there, and then we go stair ladder there. Ah, that's going to use up my two nails. Right. Nope, it doesn't go up against something. We've got to do that as a separate thing. So I've got to remove this one there. That's gone. And there's no other bits have been removed. That's fine. So then I can go here to the ladder and I can put that one up there. And that will go up like that. Perfect. Right. So now I can go straight up the ladder. That's going to make life a little bit easier. I like that. That's a good idea. That's a good thing. Let's go over here and get the goo. There we go. And more goo underway. Let's put it in here. It's valuable stuff. So we want to keep it. And let's head back up to our room. Oh, hang on. No. Uh, I'm going to take some more materials. Take one of those. And I'll also go and get all the timber that we got over here. I have no more timber. I have only got 20 pieces of timber left. This is going to be a little bit of an issue because I wanted to build a huge great big thing. Now, I don't know how far I can do my thing out here. I can definitely do that. Right? I cannot build another one out here. I can only go one platform out. Oh. I also cannot build it on the corner piece either. That is a, that is another thing that I cannot do. So, how are we going to do this? How are we going to do this? I need to make this work. I've got a little bit of a platform here that I can't do, really do a lot with. So, you know what? I think we'll try and do it like this. I've, I've, this uh, we've got walls. See, walls. Right, there's a shark attack. Let's see if we can get him. Where is he? He's over here. Time I get down here, he's he's been and gone. It's it, it absolutely not happening, is it? Uh, that one. Okay, well, we can at least replace the one that he broke. But yeah, it takes such a long time to get down. I got no chance, really. I got absolutely no chance of getting all the way back down before he finishes his attack. And the armor is a really good idea. It's just that it costs so much to put the armor around. I don't think it's worth it. I really don't think it is worth putting armor all the way around our boat. Absolutely not. I, I would rather just, like, replace the pieces every now and then. Let's go back over here. Right, so I was in process of thinking about this. What does a raised floor look like? I can put a raised floor on there. Can I put a raised floor on here anywhere? No. No. I cannot do that, but I can do that. So I could put a raised floor there. Uh, no, a raised floor isn't going to help. It's not going to. It's not going to benefit in any way. So if we can't do that, the other option is, of course, we go back to this one, and we do that. And then we do this along here. And then I can just build another layer of floor out here like this. There. So I've got these bits of floor. I can only make each section of floor one wide like this. The other option is wall. But how do I build wall? It'll, it goes in red. If I can, do, if I can build it, I can, it'll be in red. I could go for a half wooden wall. I can put that on there. That will fit. I can put a half wooden wall there. You cannot stick wall to the side. You can't, like, float it in the air. Wall doesn't float. Oh, I'm very thirsty right now. Okay. Let's head down here. I got a lot of stuff in there, so I'll, I'm, I'm, I'm good to go with uh, materials. We've got a whole load of them right there. So a little drink. Replenish our stocks. I got a raft over that way. I'm actually going to go for that raft, I think. Let me fill this up. Dump that in there. Oop. And come around here. Get up to up here. There we go. And right. Where is that raft? i seen a raft here somewhere. Did anyone see where the raft was oh, over there? It's miles away. Right. We need to go all the way over that. Well, basically, I want to just go this way and then... 
that's going to bring us more towards the raft. We'll bring that round more still, so it's going like that. And then hopefully we can head towards the raft. While I'm drifting towards it, slowly, I'm going to lay down. And then I'll wake up. And I'm going to need to have... I'm going to need some food. What food have I got? i got some eggs here. I've got two eggs. That'll do. So start. I have those two. It's a little bit of moisture and a lot of nutrition, which is really good. We'll put some more seaweed in there. I'll do the same in that one. Let's store it just in case something horrible happens at the raft. I might store that as well just for a second. Okay, now we're drifting over that way. I now need to bring this one round so that we start going back up. Nope, it's a little bit too much. Let's bring it this way a bit. And in our next episode, I think I might actually set up the table again and we'll go looking for another, um, like, station place and try and find another clue about Utopia, where we've got to go for Utopia, how we find Utopia. There are many questions about Utopia that have yet to be answered, and we will be looking at ways that we can answer said questions. All right, you're coming over this way a little bit further. And then I can change the direction of the sail once again. Let's bring you over that way. There we go. Beautifully done. Pick up the crate. And we can do that. Oh, that's um, just sinking on that one. Right. There, what did I get? I got one piece of scrap. Let's go over and pick all of the crates out, or the, the barrels. If I pick up any barrels on here, how much we got? I got five pieces of scrap now. It's not a great deal, but it's better than none at all. Right. Over this way and up round there and then I can put that sail going the direction that the wind is blowing, which is about that way now. Go over there. So my little idea up here is I was going to try and like build some platformed rooms off of this. But the problem is, unless you, you've you either got to just build ramp and then floor and then ramp and then floor and do it like that, or you've got to find another way altogether of doing it. And I like the I do like the idea of having this ramp floor type process. If we do it like this, and oh, there he is. Right, this time I'm going to get him. Look at this. There. He's gone, and he's dead as well. He's dead. Uh, achievement unlocked, intermediate shark hunter, 10. I've got 10 sharks now. 10 sharks. I've also got my ship sailing away without me. And I've yet to remake my fins, which would probably be a good idea sometime soon. We ought to do that. That's, that's on my to-do list. So I've got another shark head ready to process. Ooh, I can do that. There. There. I'm going to craft another shark trophy, and I'm going to put that one straight on the wall upstairs, and that's going to be the last thing that we do today. Um, so, yeah, if you've enjoyed this episode, then please head down below and give us a like. And if you really enjoyed it, then please tell your friends all about me. Get them to come and watch as well. That would be awesome. And I'm just having a look, because Gooseman X has just come up again on... I'm sure this Google random number generator is absolutely not random in any way whatsoever. So I'm going to hit it a few times and see if it keeps coming up with random numbers or not. Uh, right. 17 has just come up four times out of about 20. And it just does, it doesn't seem very random. It doesn't seem random at all. Right. Let's do it. I'll do it now. There we go. Uh, what was that? Ha <laughs> Okay, the good gamer just came up again. That's um, that's that's one that's we've already got an, a shark head. I don't want du duplicate shark heads, right? Uh, I'm pretty sure we got that. Oh yeah, I'm looking right at him. There's Dante. Uh, that one. You know, I'm just gonna have to pick one off of here and pick one off of this list and try and remember the ones that I think are helping on this series at the moment because this random generator doesn't seem to be working very well at all. Uh, so we are going to go for uh. Ivelios. There. You've done quite a bit to help out with this series. Done. There. So, yeah, that one's come up. You two have come up an awful lot of times. And that one as well. So I would like to get shark heads for everybody, but I don't know if that's going to be entirely possible. We have another island coming up over there. So I think what we'll do is we'll just run down and um, put the sail up. There. 
so that we can just wait and we'll get that one in our next episode. But anyway, if you've enjoyed this episode, then please hit down below and give us a like. And if you really enjoyed it, then please tell your friends all about me. Get them to come and watch as well. That would be awesome. And until next time, thank you very much for watching. This is Frithgar. Goodbye and see you later.